Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at Reclaim AI and Motion and comparing both of them to find out which one is better. Now by the end of this video you're going to understand all the key differences between them and you'll be able to make an informed decision about which one is a better fit for you. So let's start with an overview. Reclaim AI is an intelligent calendar assistant that helps you manage your time more effectively. It uses artificial intelligence to automate scheduling and task management. The app integrates with your calendar and reflects your true availability, making it easier to schedule meetings and prioritize tasks. It also offers features like smart scheduling, task management and habit scheduling. Motion is a productivity tool that helps you stay focused and manage your tasks efficiently. It offers features like website blocking, distraction management and task scheduling. The app integrates with your browser and provides real-time insights into how you spend your time online. It also allows you to create to-do lists and set goals to help you stay on track. Both apps aim to boost productivity, but they do so in slightly different ways. Reclaim AI focuses more on calendar management and scheduling, while Motion focuses on managing online distractions and task management. So what AI features do they both offer? For Reclaim AI, the first feature is smart scheduling. This uses AI to automatically block time on your calendar for tasks, habits and meetings. It learns from your behavior to make intelligent suggestions about when to schedule these items. There's also task prioritization. The AI helps prioritize tasks based on their due dates, duration, and your available time. And also there's habit scheduling. Reclaim AI can also schedule habits, which are recurring tasks, for you, and will intelligently reschedule them if a conflict arises. For Motion, the first AI feature they have is distraction management. Motion uses AI to identify and block distracting websites and apps. It learns from your behavior to make personalized suggestions for improving focus. Next up, there's task management. Motion AI can suggest the most opportune times for you to work on specific tasks based on your past productivity patterns. And finally, goal setting. The AI in Motion helps you set and track goals, providing insights into your progress over time. Both tools use AI to enhance productivity, but they focus on different aspects of time management. So what about the pricing? For Reclaim AI, they have four plans. The first one is light, and that's free forever for a single user. Next up is Starter. It's for teams who need to optimize meetings and get more focus time on the calendar. And this is $8 per user per month. Next up, they got the business plan. And this is for companies who are prioritizing productivity and work-life balance for employees and this is $12 per user per month. And then finally, they offer the enterprise package, which is for organizations who need enterprise grade support and security. And this is $18 per user per month. And then for Motion, they have two pricing plans. The first one is individual, which is $19 per month if billed annually, or $34 if billed monthly. And then they have the team plan, which is $12 per user per month if billed annually, or $20 per user if billed monthly. So what are some user reviews? Both Reclaim AI and Motion have received positive reviews from users, but they cater to different needs which can affect user satisfaction. For Reclaim AI on Trustpilot, they had a rating of 3.8 out of 5 stars, and on G2 it had a rating of 4.8 out of 5 stars. Users have praised its smart scheduling, task prioritization, and habit scheduling features. However, some users have reported issues with the mobile app version and found it buggy. In terms of Motion, on Reddit, users have praised Motion's automations, the Chrome extension and shortcuts, and the meeting scheduler. In a review on Upbase.io, the reviewer praised Motion AI's technology for automatically prioritizing and auto-scheduling tasks and events on your calendar. However, they also noted that if you don't set the schedules right, the AI might schedule meetings back-to-back -back without adding a break time between meetings. In conclusion, both apps have their strengths and weaknesses according to user reviews. The best app for you would depend on your specific needs and preferences. So which one is better? Both Reclaim AI and Motion have their own strengths and weaknesses, and the choice between the two largely depend on your specific needs and preferences. Reclaim has been praised for its ability to help structure personal and professional life. Users have found it effortless to use and appreciate its seamless integrations with Google Calendar. However, some users have reported that it can be buggy, causing more stress than relief. On the other hand, Motion is appreciated for its automatic scheduling and rescheduling features, which can be particularly helpful for those with ADHD. Its meeting scheduler is considered outstanding, especially for those in sales. However, some users have found its interface to be less user-friendly on mobile devices. 
In conclusion, if you're looking for a tool that can help you structure your life with a focus on ease of use and seamless integration with Google Calendar, Reclaim AI might be the better choice. If you're in need of advanced scheduling features and a robust meeting scheduler, Motion could be the better option. It's recommended you try both tools and see which one fits your needs best. So this has been my video comparing Reclaim AI and Motion. Hopefully now that you've watched this video, you understand all the key differences between them and you should be able to make an informed decision about which one is right for you. Now, I also hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please go ahead and comment down below to say this video helped you out and also like and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching.